This is the first piece of art I made. It's a course I took in St. John's, Newfoundland. I had been in Victoria, so I had seen the mountains, but I was now in Newfoundland, and then I end up living in Victoria, you know. My fourth child was born, and I had a traumatic experience, birth experience, and I, I wanted to get out of the house. At Memorial University had begun giving adult education courses, and I took an oil painting course with my husband. Yeah, 1983, I started university at 50 years old. And I took this course at university, psychology, and it was personality psychology. We had to write a paper and I did a painting. I did this, wow. eight and a half by 11, put it in a, in a folder that you give, yeah. and I got an A. Oh, wow. <laughs> <laughs> By 1985, this was one of the paintings where the woman shows up again. I called this one the toiler, because I thought she looked like she was working hard, you know? This happens to be one of my spontaneous drawings of a woman, pregnant of course, and there's like two women in there. Uh -huh. I called it my mother's. Okay my inner mother and my outer mother. This was my garden towel. I grabbed it, bunched it up, and wiped off this canvas. Threw away the towel. The next day when I decided to carry on, I went out, pulled up, lifted up the towel, and here was a woman. <laughs> I felt this was a healing journey. So I thought, I'm gonna use my tiles. I have thousands of these. And so I decided that each painting that I would do in this whole series would be a art heals and art saves. At first I thought she was my mother and my mother was a very, a very wonderful, salt of the earth woman but she never been anybody but Eva and me yeah Eva was my mother so yeah. no it's me it's yeah. all aspects of me